Today, we're talking about becoming an amazing public speaker. Hey, it's Tom Jacobs. Thank you so much for tuning in to this special training session on becoming an amazing public speaker. I'm sure that is exactly why you are here. And I wanna share a couple tips to make sure that you are getting to that point where everybody's listening to every single word that you're saying. So at the end of the day, a public talk, when you're up on stage or in front of a camera, it becomes a performance. Don't think of it as a presentation because presentations oftentimes are boring and you know, a little overrated. You want to do a performance. And if you think about any good Broadway performer or actor that's on television or in the movies, they have rehearsed over and over and over again and they have a script that they follow. Well, why not do that for public speaking? Because that, at the end of the day, is a performance. So what I do for all of the stories that I tell and all of the speeches that I do, I write them out in painstaking detail so that I'm sure that I don't ramble on, I have the right structure in place, and I say the right words at the right time. It's not that I actually memorize any of my speeches or even what I'm talking to you right now. This is not memorized, but it has been planned out and I've scripted it out as well. I know for the most part what I want to talk about and it is right up here in my head because I've rehearsed it over and over and over again, just like any actor or performer has done. And that, my friends, is the number one thing to make you a better public speaker is to make sure that you are rehearsing over and over and over again your script. Now, this is something that I have all of my clients do that go through the Dramatic Impact Story Academy is in painstaking detail write out their stories and then we rearrange it and, and refine it so that that story is complete because there's nothing worse than going to a presentation or a performance now where the storyteller just rambles on and on and on without actually making a point. And the further part of that is not only do you want to make a point in your presentation, but you want to make some profits as well. So how do you tie that story into then asking for something on the back end of your talk? And that's part of the whole program that I go through. But today, I want you to start practicing on your performance and scripting out your talks so that they make sense, they're in the right order, and you are getting people to do something. There you go, my friends. Number one, how to become a great performer and public speaker is to rehearse and script out your talk. Well, until next time, you have a great day.